he wants to unleash the power of freedom, the engine of prosperity, laissez-faire capitalism. I'm a fan of Ayn Rand and Atlas Shrugged, and uh, she, she, she knew that we need to defend capitalism and, and freedom because it's not only morally right, but it is an amazing engine for, for prosperity, for you know, curing diseases, creating factories, and, and creating jobs, and solving the problems. And government, on the other hand, is the complete opposite. It messes up almost everything it touches. And Ron Paul is the only candidate that comes close to advocating those things. A lot of people running, especially in the Republican Party, talk about lowering taxes, talk about you know, reducing government and doing this and that. And what happens? They create Medicaid uh, drug benefits. They put tariffs on uh, steel imports. They do all sorts of things that go against free trade and freedom. But Ron Paul has a record of doing what he says. You know, he's a man of integrity, a man who has a certain set of beliefs that happen to be the right ones, and he lives and he votes by them. So that's why I'm an enthusiastic supporter of Ron Paul and have been trying to get all those people that were supportive of my Lost Liberty Hotel project to uh, join me in supporting Ron Paul. Um, and so, why should we give Ron Paul our all? Well, a man like Ron Paul doesn't come along very often. You know, usually, if every, four years rolls around, we're like, oh gosh. <laughs> we hold our nose and, you know, vote for one of the two people. Ron Paul is someone that we can vote for and cheer. Okay, so a man like Ron Paul doesn't come along very often. 